Whether their teams are peewee or pro, but Darvon Woods Charter Academy said more than its usual turmoil. The night team's Randy Ayala saw it come to a head tonight between school leaders and parents. What brought it to this, Randy? Gordon, Natasha, many parents are upset about Coach Chris Robinson's dismissal. They say Darbone Woods has been firing coaches left and right, and the ones hurting the most are the students. Friday night is the next game for Darbone Woods Charter School's football team, and one person will be missing from the sidelines. The day I was fired, I had 62 kids in this house. Many parents and students are still reeling from the firing of Coach Chris Robinson. You are one special young man. I'm blessed to have coached you. Keep grinding. Love the drop. In the past four years, we have had three head coaches. Our football team is devastated by the loss of Coach Rob. The coach says it's been an ongoing battle getting his team ready for the season in the safest way possible. I stayed because I love those kids. Biggest concern was the where we were playing wasn't safe. You know? He says he had to fight for uniforms, equipment, and team meals before games. He believes the final straw came when he went to talk to the athletic director after hearing some were spreading rumors about his family. Fortunately, um, I, I did report it. I shouldn't have reported it. School officials won't comment on his termination. You cannot address anything to do with the reason why we're here. But parents say the solution is simple. Just get a man's job back. He gave his heart and soul to those kids. They say the kids lost their leader just as the season started. It's detrimental. You know, don't punish the kids like this. Coach Rob gave the board permission to release his personnel file. There may be another public meeting where parents will get more answers. In the studio, Randy Ayala, NBC 10, your local news leader.